Welcome back to Livy's Lovelies, your inspirational craft channel, and I'm your host, Sam the Fabulous. For more ideas, inspiration, swaps, and challenges, click the link in the description below to join our craft community, The Maker Exchange, on Facebook. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, all my artists, creatives, crafters, and makers. Welcome back to The Lovely Life. Okay guys, so I am excited to pop on and share with you some happy mail that I got in. And actually, this box came in the mail one day, and before I could even open it up, come the next day, this package um, arrived. So, and my son, he is, you know, because he's getting older. We live in the country, so our yard is... It's not like it's expansive. It's just that we don't have sidewalks out here. So when he goes to get the mail, he's essentially, he's got to walk on the, on the road to get it. And um, so it's it's kind of an exciting thing for him every day to go check the mail. Sometimes he'll be like, at 10 o'clock in the morning, can, uh, can I go check the mail? I'm like, um, the mail doesn't even run till 2 o'clock. So how about no? And then sometimes at 2 o'clock, he'll go get the mail and be back out there asking, can he go check it again at 5? He knows that mail only comes once a day. But the thrill of being in that road, unsupervised, although I'm looking out, my, out the front window as he goes out there each time, um, is just, you know, for a boy, that's everything. But And we also live right across the street from the ball fields, uh, baseball fields and up the road from the beach. So sometimes it's a, quite a bit of traffic depending on the day of the week it is. Anyways, I shared that all of my mail, uh, you know, excitement with you to lead up to who sent me this. Now this mail came from Tam from Bible Journaling on a Budget. She also has the channel Tam's Journals. Now on Bible Journaling on a Budget on that channel, she um, regularly pops on to share her Bible journaling entry that she creates on camera. And, you know, I'm always amazed at the amount of time that she can get done, the entries that she gets done. And she typically uses, you know, the art supplies that we generally all have in our craft spaces. But believe you me, in order for me to produce what she produces, it would be, I'd have to put it in speed up mode for you guys to sit through it all because it would take me about an hour and a half to figure out narrow it down determine the placement and the coloring and you know all that other stuff that's why y'all don't see it here on this channel every once in a while i'll throw up a journaling uh but you never watch me journal i never have a journal with me session because y'all ain't got time for that and and i don't want to torture you with that maybe one day when i'm a little bit more confident but that being said, Tam's got that on lock. So if you are interested in anything pertaining to Bible journaling, check out her channel. The link will be below. And then she also has Tam's journals. That's her other channel where she um, creates journals or, and I think she does journal entries, different, you know, regular daily journal entries. And I've seen her do some collaging with magazine, um, you know, like uh, faces from out of the magazine. And again... I admire from afar because that really is, it is not my, uh, <laughs> I'm not gifted like that. Let's just say that. So anyways, now I'm not going to, um, I was going to share her address because she often, um, sends out pen pal mail and she always asks that if you want to be, a, um, if you want to join her pen pal list to, you know, she has her own steps. So if that's also something you're interested in, head over to her by one of her two channels and um and i'm sure she'll make that announcement in one of her videos but all of that being said guys i'm gonna go ahead and open up carefully open up i think i'm gonna open it up from the side why because um her pen pal mail envelopes are a work of art now this is just something i put on here to cover up my address but she has a way of adding beautiful little decor and um onto her envelopes to make them worthy of art and honestly i took one of the last one that she sent me and i turned it into a journal uh because i was able to i didn't uh get crazy when i was opening it and i kind of kept it all intact so i was able to um take it fold it in half 
and insert papers. I'll show you how I did it. So I took the papers, I did it like this, and turned it into a journal. Papers on the inside like that, in which, of course, I'm going to figure out a way to re reuse this because it's art, you know, and I appreciate it. So this is what Tam sent me. This looks like Illustrated Faith. That's what that looks like. Oh, okay. Oh, it says, fam. hi, fam. Just a small token to say thank you for your love and support on my YouTube channel. Oh, you're welcome, Tam, if you're watching. You are most certainly welcome. And I, I do, you do not have to thank me for that. I enjoy supporting your channel. One, because um, I do appreciate you. And I always say it, being obedient to the Holy Spirit and um, sharing the message that you get from the scriptures that you read during your Bible journaling. Be oftentimes, Tam, when you do your um, journal entry and the passage that you read from, it always, always, whether I am watching it in the, you know, watching it a week later it falls in line with something that I'm either going through, a message that I've been given, or something that's already in my spirit. And I, and I say always because there has not been a time where I have sat and watched your video and it has not resonated with me. So, um, and God links people with other people for his purpose, you know, anywho. So, you are more than welcome and thank you for supporting my channel and for also sending this little token of appreciation. Okay, so it says, be grateful to the people who make us happy. They are the charming gardeners who make our souls blossoms. Amen. Oh, isn't that pretty? I love this color palette with the, this, uh, what is it? It's kind of like a mossy green and then the oxblood red and a little pink there. And then, of course, my favorite, the uh, antique teal. Oh, orange and spice. Well, it's been a minute since I've done my tea and um, my sip and share Saturday. So I have to pick that back up in the fall. I'm going to start stockpiling some teas. So, okay, this is orange and spice her herb tea. Is that the blend of orange and spice? I like anything with a spice on it, you know. So I'll be using that. And then what else is in here? Let me just slide everything out the bag so I can reuse it. Yes, I reuse the bags too, people. And you should be too because we don't want this to end up in the land, in the landfill. Now, faith is the assurance of things hoped for and the conviction of things not seen. Amen. It certainly is. Now, that's really cute. For some reason, I feel like this needs to be in a journal as like a, you know, a flip, a pocket, you know, not a pocket, but a flip. So she sent me, okay, this is, looks like a couple cardboards, uh, postcards. Yep. 100 postcards to contemporary pattern designers. That's cute. And I always see her with the vellum stickers, and I'm always so jealous because I don't have any. I don't have any, Tam. So thank you so much for sending that to me. I do need to go on. I'm always hesitant to order from Al AliExpress because I never know what is a replica of an another name brand. So. If I, and, and to be honest with you, I'm not up on all the brands and who, who made what and which design is from whom. So I kind of stay off of there. Um, I'm okay buying things like lace where, you know, there's no designer that has trademarked a lace pattern or a crochet pattern. So I'm okay with that. But um, to get your money's worth, Ally Express is, you know, usually the best place to go. So I've got quite a bit of die cuts. I forgot what this is called, but I know that they used to use those in the doctor's offices and it ticks back and forth. Some little um, floral die cuts. I think I have a sticker like this from Illustrated Faith, The World, which is what women represent. The World. How pretty. Look at that butterfly. Let me make sure we're going to focus here, folks. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, look at a washi tape sample. Hello. This is a um, damask print. I had tried to remember that word on another one of my videos. Could not. Could not. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Four different um, samples I got there. 
Isn't that pretty? This little tag here. And a cute little envelope. I can't wait to use that. I don't know what you can fit in it. I mean, besides a little die cut like that. But don't you worry. I will be using it. A spicy morning. This coupon entitles you to pizza for breakfast, warm or cold. You choose. I'm sure Josh would absolutely. That would make a cute little um, coupon for Josh. I think I'll turn that into um, give him a... Thank you, Tam, because now I just got a good idea. I'm trying to make going back to school special. So I think I'm going to make Josh a card, a back to school card, and um, put this in as a coupon for him. So on one of those mornings when he wakes up and he's in the mood for pizza, because there's not a day that he's not in the mood for pizza. He can present this, and then I'll, if we have it, obviously, I will give that to him. Amen, 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 amen. You see that? Ooh. A piece of vellum. Uh-huh. Look at this pretty flower. I would love to try and watercolor that. It would be nice if I could actually handle watercoloring. Anyways, we'll see what we do with that. Um, I probably could use the creams and, and um, cream sticks and blend it out. Better off like that. Okay. Gratitude is looking on the brighter side of life, even if it means hurting your eyes by Ellen DeGeneres. Okay. That was on the opposite side of that. I can't wait to dip into that. All right. So now I'm not going to, I'm going to slide on into this box, which was sent by Tam as well. And, um, I got my, my scissors handy. Tam, um, what kind of tape is this that requires a sawzall? What is that? Is that like, what kind of tape is that again? I hope I didn't cut that, but I sure did. Did I cut that box? Lord have mercy. Trying to get that uh, tape off of here. I messed around and cut the box that I feel like I'm going to have to want to use again, but it's okay because I can um, probably put some type of uh, image on top of it. And reuse it. Let's just see it before I start making plans for the box, right? As you know, we like to recycle. There's nothing wrong with it. Upcycle, recycle, resend, regift, waste not, want not. Okay, so how do we open this? Okay. All right, so yeah, I cut that box right there, but fear not. It looks like it's covered with some type of paper. So I can do the same thing. All right. Oh, I'm not going to. Um, let's see. It says happy birthday. Oh, Tim, I'm opening it in my birth my, my birthday month. It is going to be my birthday this month. Thank you for remembering. Wait a minute. Don't you got a birthday coming up too? Or is it Faith? Faith from Faithful Mess, guys. Faith has a birthday coming up this month too. Oh, it says happy birthday. Oh, look at her. She made this car. You did a wonderful job, Tim. And I hope that you enjoy what I sent you in your package for your card making adventures. Because I saw your last video and I, and I enjoyed watching the process. But girl, go with your first instinct because your first instinct was always is, has always been right on those cards. Okay, I'm going to read this later because it, is, it has sentimental value. Thank you very much. Oh, oh something in here smells good. Oh. What is that? La that smells like lavender. Okay, let me not get too excited. Okay, so we got what I'm um, too late, right? We got washi here with script. Never had it. I'm so excited to have it. Oh, we've got a wide one and a thin one. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Tam. Oh, and I hate to say this, but this is probably be the only crafting supplies I get for my birthday because my husband will probably do the opposite which will be something for the family. So I, I really appreciate having crafty friends who knows, who know how to celebrate a crafty friend's birthday with crafty stuff. So thank you so much, Sam. I'm like, this. you could have sent this and I would have been like, ah, well, she for my birthday. But you didn't. You didn't stop there. I don't even want to. Okay, let me open up this. Talk about excited. Okay. Oh, man, do I feel blessed. Okay, let me stop hogging your time too. Okay, what do we have in here? Oh, 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 yeah. What? Well, these will make some 
Okay, so this, look, is this a sticker? Why does this feel so thick? It is a sticker, wow. Look at that embossing. Do y'all see that? Let me make sure y'all getting a good, look at that, that is gorgeous. I don't have anything like this in my um, craft supplies. I mean, I know I'm limited, y'all, so a lot of that has to do with the fact that I don't like to shop, but that doesn't mean that I'm not on the online looking for stuff. It just means that I don't pull the trigger. Oh, the gosh, that's gorgeous. And I've never seen it. Is that kind of like a vellum? Oh, it is. Damn, that's gorgeous. Where did you find that? Anywho. Okay, let me stop being so nosy and just be appreciative, and which I am. I'm just appreciative of that. And look at the cute little envelope that she sent that in. Okay, let me put that off to the side. And happy, this is happy birthday. Happy birthday to me and everybody else's birthday is this month. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited and so grateful. Talk about grateful. I think I'll save this bag for Josh. Because he likes to. Oh, this smells like lavender. Oh. You know what? I need to try and save the washi if I could see where to. Okay, I'm not going to hog your time with my wanting to recycle everything. Oh, gosh. This smells heavenly. I wish you guys could smell it. Oh. What? Centicate. Oh, wow. Oh, that smells heavenly. Lavender. See, this is when you know someone is listening to you ramble. Ramble. Because I know I've said it quite a few times. But I'm never, I am never have a video saying, I like lavender. Send me something. So it, you have had to have watched my videos, paid attention, and heard me in the midst of my rambling to know that this is my favorite scent. And for some reason, it, the 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 um, compulsion for it has multiplied ever since having kids so thank you so much tam and then there's one last envelope in here oh my oh tam do you have that look at the wax seal i feel like i don't want to open it right now i don't want to break the seal <coughs> not that it's the seventh seal <laughs> is, is it the seventh seal that's in the bible that's so fancy Look at you, Tam. How do I open this without breaking the seal? And what will happen if I break the seal? You know? Who's to say? Who knows what's actually going to I'm looking at the sky. Nothing. Oh, it's a little gray over there, y'all. Okay. That's just so fancy. This needs to be in my journal somewhere. Just for fam, it says. Did I, not, did I totally bypass this part? And got sidetracked only exclusively on the seal. Anyways, that wax seal is something else. Okay, stamp share journal. Oh, oh, I you just had a um, you just had I, I see you have a video up, and I was waiting until I had my lunch so that I could sit and watch that while I eat because I, I some videos I'll have playing in the background, um, and then other videos I actually like to pay full attention to. And that's, that was one of them. Stamp, share, journal. <gasps> Look at those images. Y'all not about to see all of this. This is going to be a whole nother video. So don't even, no, I'm not sharing this with you guys. I'll share that in another video. That'll be an exclusive video, okay? Stay tuned. That'll be the next video. I ain't going to hold y'all much longer. Anyways, thank you so much, Tam, for celebrating my birthday with me, for sh sh your token of appreciation. Thank you for supporting my channel, and thanks for always being in my comments and, and encouraging others to stop over to my channel. And you know I try and plug you as often as I possibly can, and considering how often I run across things that you've either sent or you've used or some advice that I've gotten from you, you're typically in the bulk of my videos. So um, I hope that you enjoy your package as much as I am have enjoyed opening and receiving the blessings that you've sent me and i just want to let you know that i appreciate you and what you bring and offer the craft community and the world at hold all right and 
until we all are back here on YouTube, guys, stay encouraged, stay blessed, stay creative and crafting. And don't forget to check below for Tam's um, two channels. All right. And don't forget, she's got an Etsy shop. She's got some amazing journals there, too, as well. They'll be down there in the description box. Bye for now. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Hit subscribe to join the crafty community and be sure to click the bell for notifications of new uploads. Thank you so much for watching. Now stay tuned for more from Lily's Lovelies, your inspirational craft channel. Bye for now.